Hello everyone and happy belated Valentine's Day. I was really too lazy to make this video yesterday. I was like really really lazy and um, truthfully I really didn't want to, I'm just adjusting the camera, I really didn't want to do the red and white because I did lots of red during the Christmas holiday. But I just remember that Emma has this cute dress. This is by Jess One U. And this peach and white with the little aqua blue in hearts. I think that's perfect for Valentine's Day. Now, yes, I'm a day late. Today is Wednesday and Valentine's was yesterday, which is Tuesday, but that's fine. You know, better late than never. And the diaper cover is in this plain peach uh, color. So she's going to do that. And it's a real warm day. So she's going to wear these white sandals by Koala Baby in size zero. And um, wow, I forgot to take out her headband, but she's going to also wear her white sucky now I say sucky because this is what I always call my last little girl she was the only one that took the pacifier and with my last little girl we called it sucky so Emma's gonna have her white sucky but um let me just quickly look for her white headband okay it's right here I have it right here Okay, so she's going to wear this white headband. And um, I forgot to cut on my room light. So let me go ahead and cut on my room light. I'm pretty sure my husband will be... I, you know, you just can feel... I can feel that he's going to be home any minute. Okay, yeah. So that's what Emma's going to wear. So let me see if she needs to have a pompous change. I don't think so. No, it still looks pretty good. So I'll just freshen it up, really. Yeah. Let's freshen it up. So I hope everyone had a beautiful uh, Valentine's Day yesterday. I have noticed lots of pretty pictures like on Instagram. And I've been watching the videos, the Valentine's Day videos. And I wanted to make one. I just really didn't want to do the red really I, I just didn't feel like the red for me so I was so happy when I remembered this dress and this dress is something that I had purchased from the teacher's pet her online sale so this is perfect okay so let me go ahead and put her diaper cover on so yesterday um I didn't celebrate much. My husband had to travel, but he came back yesterday evening and um, he bought, we normally buy like the little heart box of chocolate for my daughter and he bought her a really big box because he said they, you know, they were out of the small one. So he bought the big box and um, he asked me what I wanted and like I said, ladies, I stopped asking for dolls. So I told him I wanted uh, shoes. So he gave me the money to buy my shoes. And truthfully, yes, I bought two pairs of the Arizal shoes. Are you familiar with that? Yeah. They make very good shoes. And they make them in larger sizes, like for women who wear up to size 12 yeah so um i can tell you that i i was sort of surprised because i have a closet full of their shoes they're very good quality shoes and the heels are made a little thicker so they're sturdier like for a heavier um set person like myself being full figured and um yeah, so I have tons of pairs from this particular company and I had ordered the shoes because they, they're having an online sale 
you spend $75 and you get free shipping plus you get 20% off and their shoes are normally like $79, $89. So what I did is my husband always treats me to like gifts during special occasions and in most cases he would ask me what I want and he would give me the money to purchase what I want. So I went ahead and ordered these shoes a couple days earlier. Um, I think I ordered it maybe last week. Was it last week? Maybe last week. Um, I don't know. Was it Saturday or something? Yeah, because I wanted to catch the sale. Plus, the size shoes that I wear um, isn't always available. So, seeing that they had my size, I went ahead and ordered those. But I was surprised that the company had sent me this um, email asking me to contact them. And so I did. And um, they just wanted to verify my shipping address or something. So, uh, so when I called and they said that they wanted to verify my shipping address... Because their records were showing that my, either my shipping address or mailing address was not correct. So I gave them my shipping address and mailing address again. And they said, still the showing up not correct. So I said, you all have a history of my purchases. So I don't see what the problem is. So um, the lady went back and she looked at my history and she said, yeah, so she don't understand why they overlooked that. But the last purchase was showing 2014. Now I was like, 2014, but you know, it makes sense because when I started collecting the dolls, American Girl dolls, I really stopped buying for myself so much so i know i've purchased their shoes um i have made but not from this company i amazon also sells this company online so i'm sure because i did purchase two sandals from amazon but then it was just surprised that I haven't um surprised but still not surprised that I haven't been shopping at their main store or online at their main store from 2014 and it makes sense because when I started collecting the dolls that's what I started doing I started buying because in total I have maybe I probably have almost 50 American girl dolls in total and it's just not just American Girl dolls. It's American Girl dolls. It's my twin dolls. It's um, Harmony Club doll. My siblings, my pal doll. Yeah. So I said, okay, well, okay, yeah, well, that makes sense. So now that I'm coming to. I wouldn't say an end in terms of purchasing the Reborn dolls. No, I wouldn't say that. But um, yeah, I'm getting at a point now that I know that, you know, I don't want to keep collecting um, more than I can enjoy, you know. So I started um, collecting my shoes again, really. Yeah. So, I do, I am expecting a little girl. And, well, no time soon because she is, she was pre-ordered and she haven't even been shipped out as yet. So, that's going to take a while. And then, I have my mind on another doll, which won't be any time soon. So, I'm, I'm coming to the end in terms of collecting my reborn dolls. And then I just want to enjoy the ones that I have. And um, yeah, so then I can start 
treating myself again because honestly I haven't treated myself well you know I did I, I did purchase like charms for my Pandora bracelet see I was doing that so I I'm finished with the Pandora I'm yeah I'm finished I'm happy with the collection that I have so I'm going to start probably collecting my shoes again because I really do um, love stylish shoes yeah so here's my beautiful girl all dressed for Valentine's in her cute little dress by Jess One You and this is peach and white with the little aqua uh, the peach the hearts are in peach and aqua blue and it has the dress has pockets trimmed with the aqua blue and this is have the cute little bows here uh yeah in the aqua blue very cute and the peach diaper cover and i accessorized it with her white headband and also her white sandals by koala baby yeah so that's my beautiful little girl, Emma, all dressed in her Valentine's Day outfit. And even though she's a day late, again, like I said, it's better late than never. So that's it, everyone. So thank you all so much for watching. And I hope you all had a beautiful and blessed Valentine's Day. So thanks again. Bye-bye.